insult. I think Chloe is just loving every second of the attention. I relate to her. Like, I just feel like she's a bit of an attention seeker. She blooming loves it. And so would I, do you know what I mean? And obviously, like, Brad's a good looking guy, so she's gassed off it. And I think Brad isn't attracted to any of the girls in the villa. And I think he's just attracted to her the most, but not necessarily that attracted to her. Yeah, I that think, sense? I think <laughs> these two sense. new guys who come in, Chugs and Liam, our brick Leo, oh I think she God. might flirt with them as well. Did anyone, can we talk about Chugs? Can, like, can I just say something here? <laughs> like, I, I like to be kind of, what's the word when... I like to be partial on this podcast. Impartial. Is that the right word? Impartial on this podcast. Sorry, <laughs> the complete opposite. It was, only, it was only the first two letters missing. Um, but <laughs> is his name Chugs? Or is that a nickname? Because if oh, that is his nickname, nickname, I'll be honest with you, it's game over Kem, for me already. Yeah, Kem, I'll be honest. I heard the name Chugs and I thought it was an advert for Justy. E. I was like, yeah, I'm ready to turn this off. You know, the way he was bowling, there was no energy. There was no like, you know, tonight on Love Island. It was literally like... Hi, my name's Chugs. So and, uh, it was so no. relaxed. I, I, look, I, I took a second glass of the TV. I was like, is this show still going you know on? Like, I think he's going to be brilliant because he was quite upfront and saying, I'm not here to mess about. I'm not here to make friends. I will happily steal your girl. But also, did anyone notice whilst he was saying this that he, he was moving his chest whilst he was doing it? Like, do you oh, know what I mean? Oh, doing a pet dance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I was yeah, so yeah. distracted by the nipple movements whilst he was doing he was a pet doing dance that. in his interview. <laughs> I couldn't believe it. <laughs> <laughs> it's a talent. That is so funny. I but can't do that. Just, the, the, name is, the name is funny, yeah. but I feel like the face strangely matches the name. Like, it just, do you know what I mean? Like, I looked up at this, I heard Chugs, and I looked up at the screen, and I thought, this makes sense. I don't know how, but it makes sense. But do you know what it is? It's like, you know, in their interviews, you feel like, I, I do feel for him as well, you feel like there's nothing you can say right in their interviews. Like, he, he said himself, do he's going in the villa to make friends. He has enough of those. He's not going in the villa to make friends. He's got enough of them. He's not afraid to step on toes. Did, did you? Do you remember your first interview? What you said? I said I'm cheeky, spontaneous, and sexy. <laughs> I think I'm all three. I think I'm. I still think I'm all three of them things. <laughs> yeah. The minute if you said cheeky, I'd be like, what? <laughs> yeah. No, well, um, and the second guy going in, Liam. He's a bricklayer from Wales. He said he can't wait to stir things up. Apparently, his mates call him Mr. Steal Your Girl. Look, when you come in with comments like that, what do you expect? Mr. Steal I mean, Your Girl. I mean, it's one of them ones where I feel like if you're going in like, as a bombshell, you have to give it large. I think Love Island in general, you have to give it large. But whether or not yeah. people actually back it up in the end is, mm. you know, that's what we love to see at the end of the day. So he can, one, I, one, I'm not, like, I feel like he could steal them with his personality. Exactly. But like, he, I, I, don't, I don't know. Like, he doesn't instantly strike me as someone that would steal a girl. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> I have to say, so when Toby first went in, he said that he's in a lot of DMs, yeah. A oh, lot yeah, of DMs. He did. And going off his date and how like, I don't know, like I, I feel like for me now, Toby could be one of my favourite contestants ever. Just off that yeah. date. Oh, I agree. I, yeah. I agree. He's the most genuine person. Like that, that date yeah. for me was just like watching a real life date. Like he's just... It's something about him just so likable. He's a sweetheart. Yeah. He's so excited about everything. The lights, the dressing room. Like, I love him. I really, yeah. I'm really excited. He's really but at the me. same time, going back, well, going back to what he said, I don't know if there's as many DMs as he thinks, as he said. <laughs> yeah, That's all yeah, I'm yeah. saying. Again, like, you know where people give it large for the, for the Love Island audition and whatnot and for the interviews? I feel like that's maybe what he's done. But again, as you said, Kem, he is such a lovable guy. You know? yeah, I always is. say to Eva, like, I can't wait to see him on my screen because he is my favourite. He's very bubbly. He's very fun. I feel like he's kind of like, you know, all the banter kind of runs through him. Yeah, he's kind Look, of guys, we, we, the show now, isn't he? He's we've really, all like, said yeah. bad things in our interviews, you know? like you, you, yeah. So probably if we watched all three of ours, we'd cringe. So it is what <laughs> it is, as they say. Yeah. That's why I he's can be cute, smart. Guy. 